There we go. Now then, some much needed, very much needed help. Knowing me though, I probably wouldn't run through it before too long. Sneak down we go. Is there anything coming from the tunnel? Mm, no, I don't see anything coming from the tunnel. I hear something though. What's that? Something coming from the tunnel. Yeah, that did the trick, but I don't want to be around here anymore. <sighs> I swear those zombies were continuously spawning or something. I have want nothing to do with you, I'm afraid. Yeah, I think they're just continuously spawning in this entire area. Is what's going on. Now let's see. Oh, there's a thug in there. That's that thug up there. I need to get into here. Um. Uh, here comes another one. This thing is very effective. <laughs> I'm loving it. It's not having the same... There we go. It's not having the same uh, smashing impacts as the crowbar did. But it's proving very useful so far. Hmm. Head around. Oh, hello. Mm. So I'm going to have to break my way in. Um. Let's see. Nope. Didn't manage that one. I am going to break you down, you silly door. Oh, what's up? And walk around more stuff. Um, oh, I know. One bird. Out, out. Yep, yeah, bunch of those. Why did you just die away? Wow. That didn't work too well at all. I was going to try and kill some stuff, but... Oh! <clears throat> Darn it. I was going to try and kill some stuff, but... I really messed up the start of my fury and it's not upgraded too much. Okay. Well, what? Level up already? Ooh. Well, I'm not complaining. <laughs> I am not complaining. I want to really get my rage improved, though. Since I remember I'm keeping it for emergencies, mostly. But I'm going to want to use it more often. So I'm, I'm going to be tuning that up for better use. It's very powerful, so I want to have better access to it. Wait, how did I knock it down? Never mind, I don't care. Just die. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, is it wrong that I feel a bit like a butcher right now? Uh, because... Seriously. Uh, I, I don't know what I'm saying, really. But yeah, let's just get my weapons fixed up. That was nearly two thousand dollars worth. Huh. Okay, um, can I do anything to... No, I was just wondering if I could actually mod the dangerous machete. But it seems I can't. It's got better handling on it though than... Um, 
one of my baseball bats. One of them. I think I'll upgrade it though. Make it better. There we go. Yes, it is nice and shiny, isn't it? I just want to see if there's anything else in here that I can make use of. And I, apparently I got stuck on a lampshade. Oh hey, le level 3 chest. Lethal cane knife. Purple. Ooh. Now that is powerful. I seriously need to do something about my inventory at one moment. <laughs> um, let's start dropping stuff. Drop the knuckles, drop the fair bats. Mm. Drop the hammer, since that's also quite a low level. I'll drop those and I'll take the lethal cane knife, thank you very much. A uh, lovely purple weapon. Let's see, it's um, durability is 27. Ah, earlier I was looking at the durability stat, not the handling stat. Okay. Durability is only 27, it's quite low compared to the others. But it is quite a bit stronger. I want to keep that baseball bat on though because of um, because I get bonus rage when I kill using it. But I've just dropped. I've swapped out the um, what's that? What's this here? The battery. I've just swapped out the uh, lighter of the two baseball bats I was carrying so that um, I can have the cane knife equipped. Something I have learned since the last time I recorded Let's Play is that I don't want to have too many weapons on me at once. So I try to keep equipped only three melee weapons and that's in those three slots there. Usually ranked most powerful at the bottom, weakest at the top, so that I know where they are and how good they are in comparison to each other. Then any other stuff I don't tend to hang on to. That's complete water dance. Now the water is no longer dancing. That's great. Now let's get this car and start. Oops. Hello. Um, let's get this car and start loading things up. I don't know, maybe I should actually reload that um, ripper. Sorry, load that ripper back into my slots because... To be honest, they may be a blunt weapon, but they are really, really good. I'm liking what they do. Okay, get the fuel. Load the fuel to the car. Now, I need to check for a carton of juice in there, which I can't get in, so I think I need to go up onto the roof for that. And there's a thug right by the ladder, which is just lovely. Hello there, mister. Oh good, turning away. Okay. Ow. I should have seen that coming. I really, really should have. Whoops. Oh. Still not back in the game yet. Now why did I just try to whack him with the butt of the weapon? I have no idea. Where did you come from? What the hell? I think I nearly went off the roof as well. Oops, again, nearly went off the roof. Yep, I do not want to have to deal with you guys. 
Okay, you stay down. You stay down as well. Ooh. I think I killed him by cutting his arm off. Ugh. Um, yeah, that was making me quite nervous because of, I was up high. And not really having a good time of it. Flop it to terrifying diving knife 175. That is very good, even if it's not as good as my current gear. Mm -hmm. Though I don't really like knives in general. And as I, I'm finally back to full health. Uh, um, okay, there's windows here. One of them badly cracked. What's crouch? No, no, no. No, I did see glass falling. Ah, there's crouch. Okay, way in. Though it's the intact pane that broke. That's a bit of a surprise. Though. Anything worth Whatever. anything in here? Uh, right. What have we got here? According to this, I've got a ton of red pickups right around me. Which is, I think, juice. Not interested in that. Yeah, juice pack. But if I'm carrying that, I can't fight, so I need to check out the store first. For some strange reason, I am very wary of zombies at the moment. Ah, no wonder I couldn't open it. Okay, let's get you opened up. Car's right there. I don't hear any incoming zombies. Oh, a shovel. Let's take that. Um, I can't hear any incoming zombies, so... I'm going to start loading stuff up. And hopefully no zombies will spawn just because I'm carrying this stuff around. There's one. I was afraid I'd have to go back to that other gas station that I went to to grab a juice pack from there, but well, it seems this place has plenty. If I could, I'd load the, more of them up into the truck, but I can't. It's a pity that, actually, because I'd think with the quest like this, wanted to bring stuff back, I could bring back extra, since I'm trying to help out people. But, well, I guess not. Let's back it up. It, um, be nice if the rear view mirror worked. Where am I going? I hope I don't hit something. Oh, good. Ow. Okay, I hit something. Oh, another zombie. I do not want to stick around for you, so... Out of the way, please. Thank you. I know that wasn't very friendly of me, but... She was coming to try and chew on my face or something, I think. <laughs> and that's not something I was much inclined to let me do. Oh, was that like a zombie? Okay, around the corners. Much faster than the one earlier. Much, much faster. Hello, it's you lot again. Aw, oh, there goes the windscreen already. Okay, then. Um. If I remember right, here's where I need to drop off the fuel. Uh, yep, fuel. Okay. 